up everybody what's up what's up what's good man it's your boy jonah y'all i'm just chilling man i'm on the south side you hear me and um i'm going to talk about you know you had it right you gotta have the right standards you're walking the kingdom of god today okay you gotta have the right standards you walk in the kingdom of god today okay and i'm, I'm gonna go ahead and just explain that to y'all because you know it really helps y'all in your walks with god okay and it really helps you understand what that means okay so you know i'm doing today i'm doing the videos talk about you have to have the right standards you're walking the kingdom of god today okay and i know a lot of y'all people never heard this message like this before we already know preachers never talk about that stuff okay because people don't even think about talk about some new stuff okay so um but now I'm going to talk about you have to have the right standards before the kingdom of God today. Some of y'all question yourself and say, what JC was talking about, the right standards, what does that mean? I'm so glad you asked, you know. You know, I'm glad you asked, you know, I'm going to go ahead and just open up your eyes and to give y'all understanding, to give you the truth, okay? Now, first thing this, if you're not spiritual... This message is not for you. If you are that person don't have no understanding, this message is not for you. If you are that kind of person don't have no right standards, this message is not for you. If you are the kind of person you never take no life more seriously and you're walking with God, this message is not for you. If you are the kind of person continue to follow the world, this message is not for you. Okay? If you are the kind of person you haven't heard to talk about, stop making videos. And this message is not for you as well, too. This message is for people who wants to go up higher and higher in their walks of God and this is the people who want to know the, the truth okay so the truth is y'all you have to have the right standards and you walk in the kingdom of God today let me just show you let me just open up your eyes to the truth listen up very carefully okay ears to hear minds to open okay now standard means like you know you got to focus on God you got to focus on God's will in your life. Right standard means you got to obey God, you know, and you take more life more seriously. You know, you got to be humble. You got to be patient. You got to walk in the spirit, you know, and you got to know something, okay? Right standards means you, you got to be real smart. You got to be a very intelligent. That's what God looks at, y'all, okay? You want God to talk to you, to speak to you, and give you a vision, you got to have the right standards. You got to do what God calls you to do. You got to leave people alone. You got to stop chasing around celebrities. You got to stop worrying about people. You got to stop worrying about relationships you be had. You know, put them on hold if you want them. You know what I'm saying? You got to have the right standards. You got to be bold. You got to stop being scared. And you got to stop being coward. You got to stop being childish. You got you to gotta stop being foolish. And you got to stop being gossip, okay? If You know, you got to have the right standard. You got to be very immature with Christ, okay? And that's that's the way, you know, that's the way I look at it, man. That's the reason why I'm doing videos and just tell y'all to share my thoughts, okay? To tell y'all you have to have the right standards before kingdom of God today, okay? So a lot of y'all, a lot of people, a lot of y'all Christians say, well, J.C., what about the people don't have no standards? Oh, man. I'm so glad you asked, man. People don't have no right standards, man. Like I say, people don't have no right standards, y'all. Like, you know, people worrying about this. People worrying about that. People worrying about their family. They worrying, they worrying about their mom and daddy. Worrying about their children. But they're not even worrying about God. You know what I'm saying? You know? They worry about the game, playing that tonight and all that stuff. They worry about that game. They worry about the Spurs. They worry about the NFL game and all that stuff, though. But they're not even focused on God. You know why? Because they focus on things that's not really pleasing God. You know? That means they don't have no standards. Let me open up your eyes and you emote. They worry about relationship. They worry about their woman. They worry about their man. Cheating on you, worrying about your woman cheating on you, left or right. You worrying about this, worrying about that, but you're not even focused on God. 
That means you that means you don't have the right standards, okay? You want more? Here it is. Smoking cigarettes. You don't have a right standard because you smoking cigarettes. Oh my goodness. I hate to say it, but it's true. I'm going to tell you what I know. I really don't care how people say. And I'm, I'm going to say what's on my mind because I know I'm speaking the truth. Here it is. Here it is. People don't have no right standards. You know why? Smoking cigarettes. Hustle. People be hustle for cigarettes so much. Every time I be outside, handle my business. People ask me some cigarettes. Hey, you got a cigarette? You got a lighter and all that? And I look at them, man. I said, man, y'all need to stop asking me for cigarettes and lighter. Y'all need to stop smoking cigarettes. That cigarette ain't good for, for y'all. Y'all need to leave that cigarette alone and give your life to Christ. I tell them like that. You know what I'm saying? And I could tell that people don't have the right standards. You know why? Because people walk around with pants falling down and all that stuff. I could tell they ain't got no standards. So you got some people that claim themselves they're walking with God. You know, they don't have no standards. Smoking cigarettes, smoking weed, left or right, you know. And and I'm gonna tell you something else. Alcohol. People people addicted to alcohol. You know, my sister, she on alcohol so much, you know. You know why? Because they don't because they don't have no standards. They don't have no standards for God, man. They, they're not immature. They're not even, even take more life more seriously. Now they got some people, listen up. Let me open up your eyes even more, okay? They ain't got some people out there that claim themselves they're walking with God and they still drink. Drink the liquor. Oh, go, 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 go. Yeah, man. Yeah. God is good, man. God is good. God don't care what we do as long as long we love and as long as we live with them. Really? Really? How you gonna live with God and you got this alcohol in you? Vodka? Cigarettes, smoking weed, talk about man, God is good, man. God is good, man. Look, I know, man. I ain't stupid, man. I ain't stupid. I know, I know what I know, man. Because that's a sin. That's a sin, you know. Because people be smoking weed, do all kind of stuff, follow the world, talk about they got God in their life. They liar, man. They hypocrites, y'all. And I end it, you know. This is the problem with people today. They don't have no standards, y'all. You know, artists, you know, it just you're just crazy, y'all. Now, let me tell you something else about people don't have no standards. It's sex. Oh man. Don't make me get on. Don't make me say it, man. Sex, man. People addicted to sex. Dudes want to have sex with women. Left or right. My goodness. Watch your porns. Let me be honest with you. I used to watch pornos. That means I don't have a standard because I be watching pornos. And guess what, man? I learn it just like people learn. You know, people just, you know, want to quit doing dudes. So, anyway, yeah, like I say, people addicted to sex, you know, think about fornication with women and all that stuff just because she got a nice butt and all that stuff, though. You know what I'm saying? People don't have no standard. Now they got some people claiming themselves they're walking with God. Think about women. Think about sex. You know, Christians do the same thing. Look at a woman beauty and all that stuff, though. You know what I mean? And, and, and you you can tell they don't have no standards either. I'm, I'm just being real. Now I'm going to give you something else. I'm going to give you more, y'all. Gossip. Man, gossip. Now you know, majority people out there in this world. I'm just show y'all. I just take you somewhere, okay? Gossip. People love to gospel somebody. My goodness. Gossip, man. Gossiping. Talking. Talk about people. Talk about this. Talk about that. You know, just like my enemies. Talk about me. Jonah this, Jonah that. I'm going to put Jonah in jail. Left or right. Left or right. Left or right. Jonah ain't to stop making the videos. Him and him and diaries. Making videos, just making video about that. Call us the devils and all that stuff. Talk about Jonah, left or right, left or right. They're gospeling, gospeling. Already know they don't have no right standards at all. <laughs> they don't have no right standards, man. It's crazy, y'all. Gossip, man. Here's another one. Prideness. Prideness. Talking, trying to pride. Talk about I own this. I own this. I pay for this. I own this. I own this. I'm way better than I'm smart better than I'm wise better than your ass, man. Y'all ain't y'all ain't nothing. Y'all ain't nothing. Y'all just dumb. Y'all pride, man. Wanna be hard. Thank you. Thank you better than anybody. You think everybody's scared of you. That's prideness. 
Y'all ain't got no right standards, man. People ain't got no right standards. Y'all know it. Y'all know I'm speaking the truth, y'all. Come on, let's get real, man. People don't got no standards because of the pride y'all. Pride. Pride, man. Let me open up your eyes to something else, okay? Here it is, y'all. Um, um, lust. Y'all, y'all mans are lust with women. So women be lust with mans and all that stuff. Looking on Facebook and all that stuff. Push like and all that stuff. Kick it, kick it. Girl, you're beautiful. Show your face. Show your face and all that stuff. And want the man detention and all that stuff. Lust, man. Be lust with guys. Lust with women and all that stuff. All they do, just look at the woman butt. Look at the titties and all that stuff, though, man. Lust. I already know. It's, they, they don't have no right standards. They don't have no standards, y'all. Man, I'm just telling y'all the truth. I'm just telling you what I know. People don't got no right standards, man. Let me give you more. I ain't, I ain't done, y'all. Okay? So, people don't have no right standard is like, you know, um, you know, murderer. Think about murder, kill people and all that stuff. Rob people, banks, same thing too. Rob, murderer, kill people, kill innocent people, take somebody else's life. Y'all already know. Y'all already know that people don't got no standards at all. Now they got some people out there claiming themselves they're walking with God and still kill people. Stuff don't make sense, y'all. Come on, man. It don't make no sense. People don't got no right standards at all. Call themselves they're walking with God and still kill people, man. Stuff made no sense to me at all. You know what I'm saying? So, um... Yeah, man, I'm gonna tell you. I'm gonna tell you something else. Uh, um, bay biters, same thing for bay biters, debaters. Oh man, debaters, debate, sorcerers, fungal homongers, uh, greed, greed, man. Some of y'all got a greed spirit, man. I, that really means you don't have no right standards because you're greed. You like to eat. You want to eat. Think about food too much, man. And be honest with you, man, yeah, I got a grease spirit in my damn self. I like to eat. I can't stop, man. I know I ain't got no right standards, but I'm gotta I gotta get my life right, you know what I'm saying? Because if I if I had my right standards, I ain't worrying about eat food at all, y'all. So greed, man. Um go to the bar. You know, go to the bar, go out, hang out with people, you know. Balling, having fun, and all that stuff. But let me tell you something. It's nothing wrong with having fun, you know. But you having fun, and and you know, it's all hang out with people. Don't even have God. You see, that's the problem, you know. See, that's the problem with people today. People don't have no type of standards because the world doesn't have no standards for God. You know, I'm just telling you what I know. Are you agree with me or not? It doesn't matter. So, um, I'm gonna tell you something else. Who don't have no standards is curse relationship. Oh man. Same thing. I already told women today on the, on the other video I'm making. They with their dudes. Just because he handsome, just because he got a nice body, nice tattoos, and nice haircut, nice straight locks, fresh lining, smell good. Man, you know how ladies are, man. Ladies just looking for a guy with their looks instead of who they are, man. Ladies who want to date with guy don't even know who he is. You know, you don't even know the guy have an AIDS. Don't even know he's a murderer. Don't even know the guy is a psycho killer and all this and that. I already told, man, I already told y'all ladies, man, what Obama trying to do, man. They, they release murderer people out of prison. I already told y'all that, man. I ain't forgot to. I ain't, I ain't forgot, you know. Y'all ladies, man, they with a guy don't know who they are. That means you ain't got no right standards. Same thing for you, brother. Date with women's. Just because the women's got a nice butt. Be honest with you, I love women's more than you is, man. I love women's. I like light-skinned women's. That's my favorite color. I don't care what people say. I like light-skinned women, and I like white chicks. I ain't gonna lie. I say it. Can't stop me to say nothing. I can say what I want to say because cause I'm being real, man. I'm being real, you know. You know, y'all mans out there, y'all date with so many women. Don't even know the women you are. You don't even know she had AIDS. You don't even know she's a witch doing witchcraft and all that stuff. You don't even know she's doing spells. You don't even know she murder her. She murder her own kids back in the day. You don't even know she's a prostitute. 
You don't even know much about that women, man. Y'all want to get with this relationship, get with sex, left or right. And they got some people claiming themselves they're walking with God and do the same thing. Same thing. Look at women. Get with, get with this type of women don't know who they are. Get with that church woman. <sighs> Boy, let me tell you something. You get with this church woman, man, you want to catch in hell. She make sure you're going to church. She want to make sure you pay tithes and offering. She want to make sure you're being at church on time. If you don't, man, she'll be on your ass or she'll probably break up with you. She, she have your life living hell, man. It, it's worse than the worldly people. I'm telling y'all, man. Because I, I have a mama like that, man. She forced me to go on to church. She forced me to read a Bible. You know what I'm saying? She forced me not to listen to worldly music. My mama be strict on me when I was young, man. My mama trying to make my life live in hell, man. It's true, man. And I could tell they don't have no standards. And you don't have no standards because you date with different types of women, man. Y'all worrying about this. Y'all worrying about that. You worrying about finding your wife. You worry about finding your husband. You don't even think about put God first, man. That's your problem with man and woman today. Y'all never think about put God first. What's wrong with put God first? What's wrong with that? See, that was so sad, y'all. People don't have no type of standards because people don't even think about put God first. Some of y'all say, man, it's too long to put God first. God don't even send me wife. Then the Lord never, I said, well, first of all, reason why it took so long to find something what you like, what you want, and all that stuff, because you never put God first. You're never doing what God calls you to do. You never save souls from hell. You're never doing what he wants you to be. That's the reason why they took so long to send that person to your life. You know what I'm saying? God did not going to give it to you if he wants to. Let me tell you something about God. God do everything he wants, okay? You can't, you can't, you can't tell God anything. God do everything He wants, okay. So you just have to accept that or not. If you not, you can date with any woman you want to. And guess what? Your life is a living hell. Same thing for you, ladies. You know, you can find any guy you want to. I'm telling y'all. At the end of the day, your 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 life is in danger because you date with any guys, <sighs> making babies with a guy, and and, and no good. You see what I'm saying? Because you never think about put God first. That's the problem y'all ladies out there. Russian relationship, man, same thing too. You know? I'm just telling y'all what I know, and I'm telling you the truth, because I know I ain't got nothing to hide. You know? That means y'all don't have no standards, man. You got to have the right standards before God, man. You know? If you want God to bless you, talk to you, and to show you things you don't even know, you know? You got to have the right standards, y'all. And I'm just keeping real with y'all. You got to have the right standards, man. I already told you the standards was all about. You got to be on mature. You got to walk in the spirit. You got to fast and pray. You have to have a deeper one relationship with God. And you got to worship him. Worship him in the spirit. Not just the church. Worship him in the spirit. Not religion. Not the church. Worship him in the spirit. Do what he calls you to do. Saving souls from hell. Knock a people those. Do what God calls you to do, man. That means you are a right standards before God, man. You know? Did I say it clear enough? Let me say more clear, okay? Because a lot of y'all people don't understand what I'm saying. You got to have a right standards from God, okay? You got to right have a right standards for God. That's all I'm saying, y'all. I'm just telling y'all the truth and not cursing y'all. If you don't agree with me what I'm saying... Don't, don't listen to my videos because I'm not doing videos to push people, to force everybody. I'm not doing none of that stuff. I'm just doing videos and just help y'all walk with God. I'm just doing videos to help everybody. Y'all can look at me crazy all you want to. You can talk, talk, talk crazy all you want. And guess what? I already know you ain't got no right standard because you criticize people. That means you don't have the right standards. And I'm just keeping it real, y'all. You know? Now, here's another one. Lying, oh man, thank you, God. Lying, you got a lying spirit in you. Lying spirit, y'all know what I'm talking about. Whew, that's the problem. Lying spirit that means you don't have no right standards because you're lying. Lying, 
is another one. Afraid to be honest. Don't know how to be honest. See, that's the problem. Don't know how to be honest. That means you don't have the right standards because you don't know how to be honest with your life. Especially, especially you're scared to be honest with your life to God, man. Can't be doing that, man. You, you, you got to be honest with your life, man. You got, you know what I'm saying? If you have a right standard, you got to be honest. You got to be honest, y'all. Got to be honest. You, you got to stop hiding your secrets. You can't do that, y'all. Can't do that. Can't do that, man, because God knows your heart. He knows everything about you, even the devil, too. For real, y'all. Got to be honest, man. You got to be bold, man. Got to stop being cobbled. Stop being foolish. Stop being received by the devil. I'm telling y'all, man. If you're, if you're received by the devil, that makes you don't have the right standards in God, y'all. And that's all I got to be saying, man. This is your boy, Jonah, y'all. I'm just put out the truth, man, with love, man. I'm just saying from my heart, man. Nobody can stop me to doing what God called me to do. And that's all I got to be saying, y'all. This is JC, y'all. I am out, y'all. Peace.